Again, we're on the line with Terrence Oglesby, former Clemson basketball player for the Clemson Tigers from 2007 to 2009. Big, great shooter for the team when he played. Question for you is the free throw free throw shooting for the Clemson Tigers. I think you know that this was going to get brought up for sure. But uh, right. it seemed like Brownell had been doing a great job. It seemed like during the Purnell days, it was more about tempo and pace and just kind of getting a fast basket any way possible. And free throw shooting was kind of uh, not as good. And then Brad Brownell came in and it was like, okay, Brad Brownell was able to, to, to f- almost seemingly fix that very quickly. And, but this year, it seems to be struggling again. They, I looked them up, and Terrence, they, they are 301st out of 350 teams listed in the NCAA, yep. and that's that's the most teams that they list. There's more teams than that. They just won't list anymore. So there's, they're 301st <laughs> at 65.8%. Now, I've listened to the radio, and we've been on the roar a lot. I mean, it, is, it, is it something that can be corrected, or is this something that is just kind of you either got it or you don't? Well, I mean, first of all, you recruit better shooters. Uh, I, I I think uh, Brownell has done a good job of that. Now, if you really want to look deep into it, you take Clyde Trap out of the mix, and you're floating in the in the in the low hundreds. So, I mean, you'll move up 100 spots if you take out Clyde Trap. And I'm almost willing to give him a little leeway because he's coming back from a major injury and playing major minutes. And the kid shot a ton of free throws. I think if there was one positive, and there were a couple of positives, if there was one of a few positives that came from the Louisville game, I think Clyde went three for four from the line or something like that. Like it was a good number. And I think he's starting to kind of get his flow back. I mean, sure, it has been bad, but I I don't really foresee it continuing. I I don't know what you do differently. It's just um, get guys to kind of relax and just knock them down because it's all mental at that point. For Clyde Trapp, it's all mental. I mean, he, that kid's played enough, and he's a good enough player to where he should be shooting good percentages. But I, I don't want people to forget, and this is kind of the hard thing too because as collegiate basketball fans, everybody gets impatient. You want guys to be good right away. Clyde Trapp tore his ACL, and I want to say July. And now he's – getting dropped as a starting point guard in the hardest conference in the country for point guards in January. So there has to be a little leeway given there, but, you know, I I have no doubt that it's going to pick up, especially from his end. But as far as free throw shooting is concerned, I mean, you just got to knock them down and they have the shooters to knock them down. I think it's just a mental thing. And and sometimes when one guy misses and another guy, and it kind of snowballs, but I don't see it being an issue going forward. I think they were 9 of 12 at Louisville. Was it 75%? So uh, I, I, I could see it coming up substantially.